Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Yet Young Sage here. This is going to pick up right where part one left off. That's exactly where we are, so let's get back into it. We're just going to finish the GCR up. Please watch part one first. I swear to God, if this gets more views than part one, I'm going to rip my hair out on a stream. That should never happen. That part two gets more than part one. I mean, GNs don't watch in order. That's right, because it's dumb generation these days. Nobody cares about order. I know part one was a little bit messy because I was drifting off. That that repair mini game just bored the crap out of me. Seriously, because it takes so freaking long. And that just made me tired. And I was like falling asleep building the engine. We're gonna build this up. We're gonna see if we can't uh, beat beat the time that they require for that trophy. I'll have a look at it. I don't know if it's gonna be the same as it was in the other game. I'm just gonna I'm gonna refer to it as the other game from here on out. Car Mechanic Simulator slash Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 that you PC people call it. Nope, that one's broke. Well, we didn't need to. All the missteps in this in the in this bit in these two videos. I mind the bushings. That's because this this car takes extra bushings than most. I didn't calculate that. Does it just seem like we're missing something? Yes, we are. There's actually something missing. Oh wait, I know how. I know why. There's that rubber bushing that goes down here that you plop in, and then it lets you put this on, which is broken. Could be everything, except wheels and tires and body. And, well, we have to fill everything in the engine bay. And put the radiator in. I completely forgot about the radiator while we were topside. Didn't even, yeah, we didn't even have that to begin with. Which ones it need? Just the regular. Almost nothing uses the B anymore, I think. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is one of those cars where... Just like some of the cars in the old game... Like some of the, the real cars, you have to pull off the engine cover.
We're actually gonna save the drive for another video because I'm kind of up against the wall here with time. Not based on time, like clock time, but like you know, just getting shit done time. Of course, this goes in sideways, so I can't even see the uh, gauge on it. Right on. When you fill up enough of this crap, you just kind of know how it goes. Again, just get one, uh, not you. That's for that piece of shit out front. For simplicity's sake. Might be a little too far over. Slightly too far over. One, one more space to the left would have been better. This was left in there by accident. I thought I cleared the entire car. I guess I didn't. I know the tires were different. Uh, two five five forty R twenty in the in the front. These are thick boys. And since we're going for the time, we're gonna go for slick tires. We're gonna use slick tire B's. for the GTR in a 20. Should make this easy on ourselves. $4,800, holy Christ. Those are some big boys. I'm pretty sure it's the biggest wheels we put together on this game. Uh, those monster truck wheels on the on that F three fifty in the last game. <laughs> that was well, that was a meme machine. So, and the fronts were two eighty five thirty fives.
for their backs. It's just double checking. Look, off, those seem awfully skinny. I still can put silly wheel sizes together, but I don't have it set up to do so. You have to enable a setting for that. We'll do the front ones first, because that's what's showing up first. I'm just lazy. just for the means. Because I wanted to see how stupid you can get with the wheel sizes, so we did. Wheel alignment and headlights. You know what, actually, we're going to run a path test. Just, just for the sake of the... I think I know why. I don't remember putting the starter in. It attaches to that fly, flywheel cover. she blows. You really got to pan underneath of the exhaust and the turbo. Glad I noticed that. Yeah, there's no interior, but we'll, we'll deal with that in a second. This thing, this thing should show 100%. Sounds a little inaccurate. color you want to paint it. I'm not keeping it baby blue, that's for sure. That's an ugly color. Apparently that's actually a GTR color. I don't know. I've never seen one like that. You know what? I'm feeling yellow, but 
We're gonna go for like a custom shade of yellow because I don't like their yellow. Go full saturation on this thing and in full brightness. I want this to be bright, vivid, like big bird yellow. Yes, that's exactly how I envisioned it, actually. Okay. So I'm going to probably assume this has no liveries. I don't see a livery thing for it at all, actually. Wait, livery set? None. Dino shop, then we're gonna go try for that lap. I'm probably gonna say about 600, so I don't think we're gonna get much extra. V8, V10, V12 is always getting the most power. So you get all the extra power from the extra cylinders. Doesn't sound half bad, it doesn't sound very accurate. Sheesh! Holy Lord! I think it's because there was so much exhaust. That might have helped too. Holy crap! Let's go to the speed track. Just try that first. Their bright yellow Nissan. <laughs> Honestly, the color wouldn't be out of place on a on a Sylvia, though. But on a GTR, I don't think I've ever seen one bright, big bird yellow. It could probably go faster if I did transmission tuning. Okay, so unlike the old one, there's no actual end to this. There's no actual end to that. It just kind of happens. By the way, I'm just going to put this out there, because this was uh, put out there. This was done today. There is a delay for the new new GTA PS, uh, PS5 and Xbox Series versions. They're putting that back to March now. I mean, this is the second time it's been delayed. Yeah, GTA and delays. They go together hand in hand, y'all. <laughs> Kind of how it go. Let me just try that actual lap. Let me look at this. One fifty. Because when I when you actually instead of killing the video when you go to the menu, instead it it just. It should be easy, by the way, because if we got that close with that with that sloppy sloppy Sylvia lap, we should easily get it with this that actually has proper tires and four wheel drive. We all know four wheel drive is the only way to go in this game.
Yeah, when, I'm, when I go to the trophy menu, or when I go outside of the game, instead of stopping it like it did on PS4, the recording, now it just straight up, it just straight up pauses it, thankfully. We need 150. And we're already away. I think the Skyline's gonna be the car, the GTR's gonna be the one you're gonna need. You gotta break way sooner than that. And I think we're gonna keep a leaderboard. Then we're gonna drive like everything that is worth driving. Game? Uh, car? Are you dead? Yeah, we're gonna have to restart. <laughs> that was an epic roll. <laughs> If I could actually go find a car that launches like that, <clears throat> I would never lose a race in Forza. Heavenly Alicorn, you would never you would never believe your eyes if you you saw a car like that in Forza. <laughs> this thing is ridiculous, dude. I know he watches his channel, so. This section is very, very deceiving. This is a much better track than the last game. The last game was a really flat track with this. This has like some elevation to it. Like the last, the last game had so, the most boring track. I swear to God, it felt so dumb, like a little go kart track. This is actually a proper car track. You can actually put cars on this thing and actually have a little bit of fun. We should do it easily. Coming in, and I think it's a 130. 132. You know what? We're going to send it to the line in the long straightaway. We're going to see what happens. We got our lap time. 132.825. I'm going to write, I'll write that down. We're gonna hit that wall at least 200 miles an hour. <laughs> what? So we're gonna wall ride it. The physics in this game, man. The physics in this game. <laughs> Never failed disappointing. <laughs> send it again. <laughs> and it's just fine. It drives on like nothing happened. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> uh, that's how you physics. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gonna hold the gas and you see what happens. At every turn. I don't know what caused that. As messy as that was, we still got a we still got 150, 153 too. 
Which is faster than the freaking Sylvia. Can we do some donuts? We cannot do donuts. <laughs> well, we got the trophy. <laughs> we we broke physics. <laughs> we did it all. We did it all, guys. Yeah, Heavenly Alicorn, I know you would hate that car if it was real. Like, if it was in force. <laughs> it kind of just does whatever I ask it to do, and it yeets on walls. <laughs> the, only way I can beat you with, the only way I can beat you is by cheating. <laughs> anyway, guys, we're going to sell this thing, and we out of here. $135,000 profit. We're going to sell this for 200 k See ya. Damn. We made some WAP, as the rapper would say. No, we did not level up. Came close. That is the rubbish machine. The shit mobile, as I like to call it. We got a box. Let's open it. So two hundred seventy-four thousand after we sold everything. Another box and scrap. Barn and a box. Barn and money. You know, because we're gonna only barns, I think we're actually gonna do more barn episodes if if people actually like them. I kinda like to see what these are actually. Argo Fox Red, Argo Fox Blue. Argo Fox Green, Car Mechanics in their greatest hits. House Radio by Petora, I guess. I guess there's mods that would like add different radio stations. Anyway, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this build on the. Scott Nissan GTR R35. I call it a Skyline for a second. Who cares? We'll see you next time. Peace out.